plan going in. He's played a total of just 15 minutes so far. Check that 19 minutes. Here's Alonzo Ball. He's really improved that shot clock. He's got to go with it. Tough shot kept alive and rebounded by Valanciunas. Here's Dylan Brooks, who's struggled shooting the ball since coming here to Orlando. Morant looking inside and now taking it out top. Jonas Valanciunas facing up against Derek Favors. Big time drive and a big time finish with the left. The league and the Players Association doing a great job. Williamson took it right into the chest of Valanciunas. Jumps. You have to guard the initial move. He's so fast off his feet, he's going to be the first to the basketball. Remember, he missed nine days to go home for a family matter and then had to quarantine upon returning for four more days to various black-owned businesses and initiatives to help out their various communities in Los Angeles and Indianapolis where Lauren is from. A great gesture by them, living it. And inside... How different would their season have been had they just been able to stem the tide there? And give credit to Alvin Gentry, right? They didn't let go of the rope early. Could have could have quit yeah. after a 13-game skid. J.J. Redick has been gold for them this year. ...to be shot by police and killed per capita in the United States, something that they're all trying to get changed. One of the things that you're struck by as you see those jerseys, Mark, is the diversity. Nice pass by Ja. His team with possession of the basketball. First day at work with the Spurs, Pop walks in and says, so I hear you're the new intern. <laughs> As only Pop could say it, right? Later went on to become the head coach of the Austin Spurs, their G League team. Here's Ingram on the wing. Great footwork and uh, tremendous finish. You know, they get on FaceTime, they go over film, and he said that he he said he likes to focus on the things Ja can improve on because Ja has the memory of an elephant, is what he called it, and he soaks up that. Jack Culture Taylor Jenkins is talking about trying to get together. Slip screen by Clark inside and finishes with a slam. Antonio Spurs in the nine hole right now. They lead them by two games. So that would trigger a play-in scenario if it stood as Grayson Allen. Clark inside, tipped up, second time, Grayson, no, that's... Miss our fans, uh, but glad that our guys are starting to find some energy, but it's high-level basketball right now. Uh, even though we don't have a lot of fans, the guys are competing hard. And speaking of high-level basketball, you told me before the game that this was all about playing Grizzlies basketball. You seem to get that. Yes. Guys in their own way. Alonzo Ball made his first three-pointer. That one rims out. Seven-point lead. And the Pelicans come back to start the second quarter with Zion Williamson in the ball game. He played five minutes in the first quarter. Grayson Allen left wide open and drains it. We'll be dealing with that guy. Tough cover, unique cover. Zion goes quick with it and gets it to go off glass during the well, There's no right way to do things. It's not a one-size-fits-all that's working out for both of them. Dylan Brooks. Tolerer. Got it. And that's what they need. Got it. And that's what they need from him. Three-point shooting. Williamson with a flush. And some pyrotechnics. Alonzo Ball sets his feet and has his second three-ball. Brooks from deep. And one and done by the Grizzlies. Here's Josh Hart. Put a shoulder into Morant, and that's an and one. Three point play at five points against the Clippers on Saturday. Tolliver misfiring. Doris, what do you make of the way that the Pelicans are playing so far in contrast to that Clipper game? That's going to be a goaltending call and a bucket. He wants to, do, he wants to maximize the three point opportunities, get in flow and read and react and play. Freedom. His team plays with a lot of pace. John Morant in. Those Villanova guys are tough, man. John Morant tough too. On the drive has his third. How many points he gets in the paint? He's just under nine points. So nine of his almost 18 and a half come right there. Ingram on the dribble. Good help by Jaron Jackson Jr. 
Brooks, a good wing defender against Ingram. Better offense by B.I. Yes. Senior at Georgetown. He was built like a brick wall. <laughs> and for a program that defined itself by defense, he was perfect for the Hoyas. No doubt. And one, Brandon Ingram. 86% from the free throw line this year. 10-point lead for the Pelicans. Under two and a half to go. Morant wants it back. Jaron Jackson Jr. with the mismatch. Too little. Jackson kicks it out to Morant. John Morant, a 35% three-point shooter. Misfiring. Great long pass. Malika, what did Jenkins say at halftime to the Grizzlies? He essentially said, guys, we are right there. We are still in this. We need to tell the, the strategy is give him a little bit of cushion. He's going to have to beat him from the perimeter. Jean Morant just 3 for 12, 0 for 7 from the three-point line. Having a tough time from downtown. Dylan Brooks on the drive. Finishing. Zion inside. Had it partially blocked. They switch schemes. They buy in. There's trust of themselves, trust of their head coach. Raptors will be a tough out. Out of the timeout, Memphis down 11. Jackson Jr. with a great spin and left-handed finish. Alvin Gentry pretty much admitted as much pregame with us. Ingram missing from the baseline. A rebound controlled by the Grizzlies. Right quickly up to Brooks. Oh, he's feeling Dylan good. Brooks has never been shot. John Morant with a floater inside, off the mark. Jackson Hayes with the board. Pelicans have numbers. Oh boy, Hayes was wide open. They couldn't find him. Kyle Anderson getting ready to come into the game for Memphis. Melly on the post up. They double team him. Good help. Shot clock down to three. Josh Hart from deep. Got it. Boy, they needed wow. that. They needed that. Gets back in the lead. Brooks. Off glass, a little bit strong. Here's Nicolo Melli. Backdoor cut by Holiday, and that's an impressive finish. Good pass by Holiday. Going to take a breather. Very impactful in those early minutes in the third quarter, and of late as well. Grayson Allen on a drive and kick. The Anthony oh. Melton. Anthony Melton from the. And rebounded by J.J. Redick. Everybody making sacrifices inside this bubble. Alvin telling us that his son celebrating a birthday today. He's not there for it as Josh Hart. Celebrating quite loudly on yes. that three. <laughs> Alvin Gentry's son, Ryan. Graduating from University of San Diego. Tolliver with the ball fake. Back out to Kyle Anderson. Four seconds on the shot clock. Slow mo does it again. Got us there. You know, we we uh, were moving the basketball, having uh, players cut and getting to spots, and uh, we decided to go one on one, and that's not who we are. Thanks so much. All Evan. right, thank you. Guys, back to you. Malika Valen. As a fan, you love just love to see. It. We would love to see it. I think this is what David Griffin referred to: the ramp up. And Zion goes right through, and, and Zion goes right through and by Valanciunas. 7 of 17 from the field, 16 points in 16 minutes. And Valanciunas with an easy one at the other end. Playing through, Jonas Valanciunas just continue to work the ball. Owen Brooks off the mark. Josh Hart on the drive. Nice step through move. And finish. Team Zion. You'll hear Alvin Gentry talk about Zion Williamson's basketball IQ. There's another example of it. Great bounce pass. 15 points in 17 min minutes for Williamson. Hands it off to Reddick. Reddick for three. Got it! J.J. Denied! He was trying to use his frame, his girth, his lower base to get Valanciunas off the post a little bit. Off the kick out. Jackson Jr. drills it. Now listen. Brent hasn't had a great game shooting the ball. Finds this shooter on the wing and Jackson had it right out. Lonzo Ball in a hurry. J.J. Redick got it up and in. Continues. Can't let miss shots. You've got a dead sprint against the Pelicans. Pelicans lead the NBA in pace. 
And Jackson Jr. blows by Zion and finishes him. It was against James Harden and the Rockets earlier this season. Made a couple of big shots. And on the way back after the second one, speaking of big shots. Play eight to ten minutes. But I think they saw fatigue. And boom, out he goes. They're playing the long game with Zion Williamson. So he sits down. They lead by four as we approach the midway point. Ingram has made so many big shots. Lead back up to seven, halfway through the final period. Jaron Jackson Jr. with a nice post up over the top of Drew Holiday. 100% healthy now and on the move. Jackson Jr. couldn't finish that time. And back comes Josh Hart. Reddick calls for it, working against Brandon Clark. Nice pass and finish and one. Brandon. AU team in North Carolina. Out of Kinston, John Morant left wide open for deep. Got it. Trying to come alive. Dot com. Don't forget, coming up next, it's the Jazz and the Lakers. After losing to the Raptors. Zion has scored the last six points for New Orleans. Up by nine. Morant flying in. That time finishing over the top. Flying in. That time finishing over the top. Ingram, a quick three, in rhythm and good. Well, this guy, he has in those shots, right? Somebody's coming close, but you need a big shot to give you some space. Morant into the paint again. Left that one short. Shot clock down to 10. Whistle and a foul going to go. Morant into the paint again. Left that one short. Shot clock down to 10. Whistle and a foul going to go. He is four of six from the strike. Jackson goes two for two. He's got 22 in the ball game. Ball working against Grayson Allen. Ingram against Anderson off the favor screen. A long two on the way. He's in a good group. And has been a big contributor here in the game's final minutes. Up top for John Moran. It never made it. Up top for John Moran. It never made it. A turnover off the timeout. The Pelicans are in control here. Under a minute to go. Ingram against Moran. And now Anderson switches on to him. Shot clock down to five. Jump ball with 3.3. Full season. Didn't start playing until late January. Ball. Williamson couldn't convert at the other end. January. Ball. Williamson couldn't convert at the other end off the air and pass. 30 seconds to go. Great anticipation by Holiday. That's why he's NBA all defense. 30 seconds to go. Great anticipation by Holiday. That's why he's NBA all defensive player. In different parts of the country, different cities. In New Orleans, Indianapolis, across the state of Louisiana. Doors, I wouldn't be surprised. To see them fall to five, delicate, maybe even six. Delicate ecosystem. Fall to five, delicate, maybe even six. Delicate ecosystem. The absence of Bogdanovich pushes a, a rotation off the bench that was already struggling to score even tougher. Brandon Clark missing the three with 18.5 to go. This will just about do it. So the New Orleans Pelicans will gain a full game on the Grizzlies. In that battle for the eighth and final playoff spot.